for a three-day tour, Prince Harry and Meghan arrive in Nigeria. According to sources, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex arrived in Nigeria on Friday and will spend three days there on a private visit. During their stay, they will meet with injured troops and visit local organizations. During a press conference on Thursday, Air Vice Marshal Abidmi Marquis, Director of Sports for the Nigerian Defense Headquarters, stated that the Sussexes are traveling there since the nation is now part of the Invictus community. Megan said to the pupils at their first engagement, which was held at a school in Abuja, the capital of Nigeria, I see myself in all of you. Students excitedly waited in line outside Lightway Academy to greet the royal couple and their dancers. They were there to launch the GANCO Foundation's two-day mental health summit. The foundation provides menstrual health products and education to girls and young women nationwide. It is truly an honor to be with you. We must recognize those incredible dance moves. My hubby was eager to get up. Megan told children in the school hallway who were applauding. Harry then plunged right into the discussion, inquiring about the kids' understanding of mental health and emphasizing the need for them to take care of one another and themselves. Will you guarantee us that, as of today, you won't be afraid or uncertain about your mental health? Ask if you are not sure. Consult your instructors. Consult your pals. Support one another, he urged.